He was so determined to support others in their struggles, to bring an end to apartheid, the death penalty, in support of the miners, as we have heard, and to campaign for peace, because it was war that had taken from him his beloved elder brother Michael. And it was also why he was so determined to commemorate in Parliament the history of those struggles, because, as he would often say, all change comes from below. He loved this place. He loved the people who built it, those who help us in our work. He loved the debate and the argument. But he did not idealise Parliament. He saw it as the means to an end, to be a voice for the movements outside of these walls who seek to change the world for the better, as well as being a voice for the people who send us here and who all of whom have the privilege to represent. And that was, I think, the essence of his character. It is from the words and kindnesses of those whose lives he touched that we, those who loved him most, take the greatest strength. After all, any life that inspires and encourages so many others is a life that was well lived. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah.